pulled into the Rikers. Let's go see how busy they are because we're going to get that long overdue oil change that I should have probably gotten done months ago. And then we're going to have them pull air in my tires because my hands are not very strong and it's such an inconvenience to do it myself. I'm weak. Alrighty, just did a quick little haul at Dollar Tree. The car is ready to go. Let's go home. Apologize for the lovely angle, but I'm trying to multitask. So at Dollar Tree, I got um, uh, a bunch of different little, like these little pots. Um, and so I decided to plant some more of the seeds that I got like weeks ago. That and some of the plants that I have currently um, needed to be transplanted into bigger pots because they were growing so well. So I've planted, let's see, parsley, thyme, oregano, chives, lavender, and rosemary. And the lavender and rosemary, from what I've seen, are very hard to do. Because I actually did plant lavender and nothing came of it. Literally, absolutely nothing has come of it. Um, and it makes me really sad because that's one that I really wanted to grow. So I planted it two different ways and I'm hoping that one of the ways will work and we'll actually get a nice little lavender plant. Same thing with the rosemary. And if not, well, we're just gonna go out and we're gonna buy it and then we're gonna just take care of it because I can take care of the plant. I have made such a huge mess though. Look at that. I'm gonna clean that up real quick. Alrighty, much better. It's actually white now. Okay, so I've bought I believe both of these are actually cilantro. I thought I only did one, but they look exactly the same. This is the one that desperately needed to get transplanted. Then we've got, I believe, this is basil. And then our little parsley. And our thyme. Thyme, thyme, whatever you want to call it. And then a little bit of oregano. Our chives. I would have this in the pot, but this pot actually doesn't have a hole in the bottom. And our problem child lavender, which I put in a paper towel in a baggie and also a pot. I just realized that that doesn't have a thingy in the bottom. And then our rosemary. So now I'm going to Label them. Ah. Look at how cute my little garden is. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love it so much. Alrighty, so please excuse my her. The boy. Oh, he lied to me. He was like, oh, I'm gonna wear those clothes. No, you didn't. Because they're still on the floor. Um. I am actually currently shopping. I finally organized, I feel so, what's the term? Like domestic goddess or something where you like cleaned everything, everything's in order and everything's organized. Can't remember what that is. Um, I finally organized my desk. I cleaned up all the rest of the little spots. It's a beautiful day outside and the wind is blowing so I've opened all of the windows. I just ordered a craft organizer for the guest room so we can officially put everything in the guest room and have nothing in the spare room. My garden, my herb garden over there which you can't see looks fabulous and I'm now actually on Amazon shopping to help organize all of this i'm looking for um like bins and other things um to organize this i've also narrowed down um organizers for the pots and pans and our cutting boards and stuff i have found a really cool organizer for all of my teas and i'm currently actually just got off the computer looking at stuff to organize like my coffee stuff here. So this is actually a Mickey Mouse bowl um, that I would like to make my fruit bowl and take all the coffee out of that and make this a little coffee station. Oh, I also need, I need a Keurig thingy of those as well. A little Keurig uh, 
K-cup stand. But now what I'm actually going to do is, I haven't actually had lunch. Bad Danny, I know. I'm going to try this Kit Kite Hill Plain Unsweetened Almond Milk Yogurt with some fruit for lunch. Even though this is a very late lunch. Alrighty, so the yogurt doesn't taste so great, but I put like a buttload of fruit. I put mangoes in the bottom and strawberries and then pineapples on top. So we're gonna go eat this and do some more online organizing shopping. Alrighty then, I have made in my giant blender, well I did the dishes one, um, well I washed the dirty dishes anyway, I'm leaving the clean dishes for Jared to put away, but I made all of my smoothies for the week, as you can tell this one is kind of a mixture because I ran out of my uh, concoction, it is pineapple, banana, apple juice, uh, mango, a little bit of papaya, did I say pineapple? And strawberries, in case I didn't say that already. And I've got one for each work day, for my four work days, work days, and then that is my um, berry sauce, which is apples and strawberries, which is where most of my strawberries went. I <laughs> ran out of strawberries already, but luckily this is my smoothies for the week, so we have to go grocery shopping again. So we have that, and then my Nature Valley granola bars that I love, the peanut almond dark chocolate. And then for my work lunch, I'll just make either an avocado or a ham sandwich, which I'm trying to decide what I want for dinner tonight. I think I'm gonna make fish and some uh, noodles, some, uh, what's it called, pad thai noodles? Pad thai noodles, is that what you're called? Stir fry rice, rice noodles, rice noodles. Yeah, that's what we're doing. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to end this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, tomorrow we've got a baby. I think it's tomorrow. Oh, you know what? I think we don't have a baby shift tomorrow. I think we have the, like, open to close shift tomorrow. I need to look at that. Anyway, um, I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye!